Welcome to the session on making IBM WebSphere development easy. My name is Paul Holm from Planet J Corporation. We're going to talk today about uh, web development with WebSphere. Traditionally, that kind of development has been slow and difficult due to complex development environments, new languages, Java, JavaScript, and bringing that all together. WOW is going to change all that. WOW is Web Object Wizard. It is WebSphere made easy. WOW is a rapid application development tool. WOW creates business data-driven web applications. For example, you can create various applications using WOW. On the left-hand side of the screen, you see a customer information system. On the right-hand side, you see a complete warranty management system, all created with WOW. You can create any type of business data-driven web application. Some of the customers using WOW and Planet J today are shown here. The key benefit of WOW is the speed of development. Wells Fargo in Minneapolis built a web application in eight minutes. WOW can also be used for business to business, business to consumer, dashboards and reporting, e-commerce and custom application development. Basically anything with a back-end database is a good choice for WOW. What we're going to do now is take an example and build an application using WOW. What you're seeing now is the Firefox Web Object Wizard. There are four steps on the left hand side for creating a WOW application. The first one is to create a connection. And a connection is a connection to a relational database. For example, the first thing you do is you select the database that you're going after. We can connect to SQL Server, Oracle, DB2, AS400, and a variety of other relational databases. The next thing you do is you specify the IP address of your database. It can be local, it can be remote, and you supply a user ID and a password. That takes care of your connection pooling. That was step one. Step two is to create an application. And an application can be any grouping of, of, of functional menu items that you choose. We're, no, we're now going to create a new application, so I correct, connect uh, click on create application. We'll give the application a name. Uh, let's call this ABC purchase order system. Uh, the goal of this application will be to create uh, a web application for viewing purchase orders. The next thing we do is we select the connection that this application is going to pull data from. And again, that can be any relational database. The theme allows us to control and adjust the look and feel, and that, that controls your cascaded style sheet, HTML, uh, behind the covers. That was step two. That is creating the application. We now have the application. Let's move on to step three. Step three is to create operations. And operations are the functional activities of your system. And we can create a new operation by clicking on Create Operation. We'll give it a label, which is the menu item that you will select. We can call that anything we want. The title appears on the top. And WOW makes extensive use of industry standard SQL. And if you're familiar with SQL, you can type it in. If you're not, WOW includes something called the SQL Assistant. What this allows you to do is point and click at your schema, your tables, select your fields as you want, and the result of that is an SQL statement that can be included within WOW. That takes care of folks that aren't familiar with SQL. They can use point and click. So we'll bring in that SQL statement. We're now going to insert that statement into our WOW repository. So insert operation. And we now have a connection. We have an application. And we have a single operation. 
Step number four is to run your application. So let's go ahead and click on that. That will launch and deploy our application to WebSphere application server. And by clicking on your menu item, executes the, that SQL, and WOW takes care of the entire job of retrieving the data, building the entire user interface. In addition to that, your entire columns are sortable by clicking on any of the columns. You can sort. Um, you also have Microsoft Excel with a single click, XML for B2B, printer-friendly format, uh, paging if your table is large, all of that built in, no programming needed at all. Now if we were going to add a new operation, a second one, perhaps that was going to retrieve purchase orders by vendor. So if we wanted to look at purchase orders for a particular vendor, we could add that in. We could either use the SQL Assistant, or what I'm going to do now is just to code in into my SQL where vendor ID equals question mark. Question mark tells WOW to prompt the user. Ask the user to select a vendor. We now have two operations. I don't need to redeploy my application. It's automatically deployed to WebSphere, and it can be made available by simply updating your, your WOW environment. And by clicking refresh, you'll see your second operation here becomes active. So if I click on that, now I can select a vendor. Let's grab uh, PC Center Computers and Parts. And here's all the purchase orders for that. We can do drill downs. We can do all sorts of uh, uh, operations. WOW is not just a query tool. You can do full transactional applications order entry, parts edit, and updates. So here we're looking at an editable screen. So uh, not just query only, any type of uh, data applications, full transaction support. OK, to finish off this presentation, WOW also includes the ability to create B2B applications, business to consumer, dashboards, as you're looking here, WOW Fusion Charts is an add-on to WOW that allows you to do dashboards, as you can see here. WOW Commerce add-on allows you to do shopping carts. The WOW Reports is a PDF a report server. WOW Google Earth allows you to extract your uh, data and, and merge it in with Google Earth. The WOW Multi-System Query allows you, through one query, hit multiple back-end databases and produce one consistent results from those back-end. It's being used by law enforcement where your data is spread out all over the place. Also called federated query. The key benefits then in summary are the speed of development, concurrent access to any of your data. You can also integrate with any of your back-end systems. Uh, WOW makes WebSphere easy. WOW will run in all versions of WebSphere. You can create WebSphere applications serving DB2. Thank you very much. For more information, visit planetjavainc.com or email info at planetjavainc.com. Thank you very much.